unknown. Let's see what happens. Hello? Hello? Anna. Who? Hi. That was whack. Anyway. So if you can tell already by the title. <laughs> It's bath time. People keep asking for puppy content, so here it is. <laughs> baby don't like the camera, baby. It's not gonna be okay, baby. Also, you're gonna hear my very obnoxious puppy voice. And in my opinion, if you don't hear people change their voice tone or like talk differently to babies or to puppies, then don't trust them. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how I give my dogs a bath. He can already tell. Baby, you can already tell, baby. So you might be wondering, Juliana, don't you have two dogs? And the answer to that is yes. The one thing is that Bella hears the word bath and then she just like skirts, skirts out of there. So I don't know where she is. So we're gonna go find her. All right, so I don't know where Bella is. We're just gonna wait for her to show up. But in the meantime, we're gonna take the baby's clothes off. He's wearing a cute but psycho shirt. When I adopted him, he was wearing it, and I was like, eh, I don't, I'm not like into that, like cute but psycho. Like it's like too like quirky for me. I'm not about it. But then as I got to know him more, it just made a lot of sense. So I was like, you know what? This is yours. Baby, you're naked, baby, so naked. All right, so. Oh. Sorry about my birds in the background. So for people who are wondering, Mimo is my rescue dog. He was abused and abandoned by his previous owner. They couldn't have a baby, so they wanted to have a dog because they wanted to take care of something together. But then the woman finally got pregnant and then they didn't want the dog anymore. So Mimo was dropped off. His original name was Evie, by the way. Evie, like the Pokemon. I know. I didn't think it was fitting because he's too like, he's very masculine and Evie to me sounds very like feminine so I wanted to change his name and he wasn't really like I mean he kind of responded to Evie but I say baby and he responds to that so I thought that was pretty close but he also responds to Mimo now we gotta find where Bella is though let's go see if she's in Marco's room she might be Marco is Bella up there let's go get her So we found Bella. Anybody else like take off their dog's collars and like tries to wear them? See, wouldn't that be cute? Kirby has a little scarf on right now, see? Her real name's Bella, but I call her Kirby and like a bunch of other stuff. So someone came over and brought my family a wine bottle and this was wrapped around the wine bottle. And we put it on Kirby's neck cause it looks so cute. <laughs> that was definition of squirrel. <laughs> Okay, Bible, we're gonna take your clothes off, Bible. The clothes, too, the shirt that Bella was wearing is actually a pant leg, and we just cut holes here for the arms. See? Mimi, <laughs> what? You come here? Come here, baby. Stop putting my butt in the camera. As you can tell, Mimo's super clingy, so he just always wants to be around me. And then Kirby knows if she's getting brushed, she knows she's about to get washed. Also notice how much better behaved Bella is because I got her when she was a puppy and for fun I used to just comb her. You're the one we all can see. It's all about you. It's all about me. You're fabulous. I'm fabulous. Oh, also mixes. So Mimo is a Maltese and a Yorkie mix. And then Bella is a Bichon Papillon Poodle. They're both mutts like the classiest mutts. All right, now that they're all brushed, they're ready for the bath. So I'm gonna go start with them. So sometimes I feel like they do that shake thing because like they think they're in a movie and like they have to do it, you know? So like kind of like over your mouth on it. So I use this for Bella. It's called the White Pearl Shampoo and Conditioner for White Dogs. It's just like this blue. I I'm like showing you like use it on you, but it's like use it on your white dog. So I really like this one because it smells like coconut and that's my favorite scent. So I have two babies, so now I have to, 
don't know. Is this like practice for when I have kids? Okay. And these are my babies, all washed. Okay, so we just got out of the bath, and everyone smells like wet dog. And I like to just hold them like this. Then I like to just watch them do this after to dry themselves off. I try to like dry them off with a towel, and I've tried the whole, what is it? I've tried the hairdresser, my dogs do not like it. I let them just kind of like <laughs> do it on their own. And then sometimes if you're lucky, they'll do like a rock dog where they have like this burst of energy and they just run around and chase each other. So let's see if they'll do it. So now what? What do you want to do now? What do you want to do? Houston, we have a problem. I didn't see my dog just pee there. <laughs> Maybe if I just like... Wasn't me. You know, instead of like getting really upset with my dog, you know, maybe he just was like anxious or he got like really excited and like he couldn't hold it in so he went. So I'm not gonna like, you know, some people like put their dog's noses in it. Like, you had an accident. No one likes to pee their pants. I didn't even see him lift his leg. Did you guys even see that? Okay, so I rewatched the footage and they're barking and then Mimo gets quiet and turns around and stand up straight and then Bella smells him doing it. And it was at this moment that I knew Mimo peed. Uh, 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 uh. Let's go see what the culprit is doing. And then maybe while we're up there, we can find like carpet cleaner and try to clean this. He's in my room. Baby, did you pee on the rug downstairs, baby? I know you didn't mean it, baby, but next time just tell me, baby. It's okay, Mimi, I forgive you. I kind of feel bad making his mistake public, you know, like putting it online. Baby, do I have your permission to put this on YouTube? That you peed your pants on camera? All right, so let's try to clean up his pee on the carpet before my mom finds out. So, oh, I have this Pet Stain Retreat Spoil Cleaner. Enzyme cleaning action. Bella, you're gonna help me clean this? Eliminates pet stains and odors like urine. Perfect, urine, feces, and vomit. Oh, it's like the trifecta. Test a small hidden area. Mm. Okay, so we're gonna try to clean the pee up from the rug. Right, so I'm just gonna dampen this cloth. Did this just become like a cleaning tutorial on how to clean your pet's pee from a carpet? Wow, look at me, two for one video. Okay, so this is our area we're working with. I'm going to spray some of this. All right, so now I'm supposed to wait for five minutes. In all honesty, I've never seen him do that. Like he just stood in one place and I, it looked like he was like waiting for like me to like play with him. He was standing there, I didn't even see him pee. He didn't even like lift his leg, he always lifts his leg. There must have been something wrong. Maybe he was like mad at me and he was like, why would you give me a bath? Like you know I don't like baths. And then he just like peed or maybe he was like, man I should have told her I didn't like baths. Like I'm just nervous and he got so nervous that he peed. Like what, I don't know. I just really hope this comes out of the carpet. Mimo, it's okay, baby. I forgive you, baby. Just tell me next time, baby, so we don't have to do this. Five minutes are up. I'm going to blot it. It already looks like a lot of it came out. See, it's like this area. It still looks discolored. Does this make it worse? You're not supposed to like rub it. Are you supposed to like maybe small circular motions? Maybe I need more of this. It doesn't look that bad. I don't know. If you were my mom, would you be able to notice? Comment down below. So now, just gonna clean up the area, but thanks for watching this video. <laughs> this Basel pet cleaner thing works. All right guys, I'm here for the outro. Fun fact, I kiss my dog's paw like she's the dawn. See you look. Bella Bachi. <laughs> it's okay, baby. We still love you, baby. Say bye. <coughs> Mimi, say bye. <coughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. <laughs>